I would say one of the things that I'm most impassioned about with what we're doing and why I think it's important is due to personal experience, I, I'm blessed to be here today, but in 2013 I was diagnosed with stage 3B melanoma. It was in my lymph nodes. Um, I was blessed to go to a couple of very well-respected institutions. One of those institutions, when I went there, really sort of held my hand through the process. They didn't expose me to things that I would not be exposed through through treatment. They told me things that gave me confidence that even though they couldn't say, I'm gonna cure you, I knew I was in good hands. The problem was, when I went home, all of that tutelage, all that guidance sort of disappeared. There was no really good conduit for me to get answers for the simple things that popped into my head that may or may not have been important to the healthcare provider. So I went to Google. <laughs> I scared the snot out of myself. I thought I had two years to live. Uh, you know, it's just one of those things that I felt was unnecessary. And if I could be part of bringing a tool to patients, no matter what their need is, whether it's orthopedics or diabetes or oncology, I felt it was important to be able to give them the ability to get information at a cadence and at a pace that they could digest and feel comfortable that what they're getting is, is right and most importantly, right for them.